some things to note here are the statement hash define the name and the value do not end with a semicolon there is no semicolon in the end the name uh, like uh, max iterations or max num or number of sensors these are called the macros and this value the value that we give here is called the macro expansion and whenever the program goes through the pre-processing stage the macros are expanded that means the macro is replaced with this value now these are just one values macros can also have arguments so we can have something like uh, hash define area and the arguments can be let's say l comma b and the expansion can be l into b l multiplied by b so let's remove this part we'll remove this we'll clear these definitions and we'll just have an area let's say in length equals to 5 and breadth equals to 10 and we'll do a print the area is percentage d and we'll give the we'll call this macro here a r e a and in brackets we'll pass this arguments length comma breadth let's build this program and let's run this so we see it shows the area is 50 this macro area was expanded the macro expansion was placed here during the pre-processing stage that is l into b and l is nothing but the length b is nothing but the breadth so the expansion became length into breadth the value was calculated and then printed here this is how we use hash defines